welcome to the Hacks and How To video channel. Have you ever wondered how to use a protractor correctly? Do you find speech marks confusing? Would you like to be able to draw a face that actually looks human? Now let's have a look at drawing an angle of 45 degrees. For this session you will need a piece of paper, a protractor, a pencil and a ruler. Begin by drawing a straight line on your page. Next, find the centre of your protractor. Place this on the right hand end of your line. If you look carefully, there is a straight line across the bottom of the protractor. Make sure that this covers the line that you just drew. On your protractor, there are two sets of numbers which go from 0 to 180 degrees. But which should you use? Don't worry, the answer is simple. Use the zero that is on the line, not the one that is hanging off into space. Carefully measure around from that zero to 45 degrees and put a pencil mark. Next, remove your protractor and join the line to the pencil mark using a ruler. That's it, now you've drawn an angle of 45 degrees. Now, before we try again, it's time for our hacks and facts. Did you know that the protractor was invented by a man called Captain Joseph Huddart in 1801? He was an American naval officer. Are you ready to try again? This time we'll have a go at drawing an obtuse angle. That means an angle that is bigger than 90 degrees but smaller than 180 degrees. Remember, if you want to go over this again more slowly, just pause the instructions. Just to show you how the protractor works from left or right, we'll draw this angle from the left hand side. Begin by drawing a straight line on your page. Next, find the centre of your protractor and place this on the left hand side of your line. Look carefully and there is a straight line at the bottom of your protractor. Line this up with the line you've just drawn. Do you remember that on your protractor there are two sets of numbers which go from 0 to 180 degrees? Use the 0 that is on the line, not the one that is hanging off into space. Carefully measure around from 0 to 130 degrees and put a pencil mark. Now remove your protractor and join your pencil mark to the line you drew. That's it, now you've drawn an angle of 130 degrees. Thanks for watching!